Hello and welcome to Ganesh's video channel. So today in this video we are going to discuss that how we can solve a particular equation with the help of synthetic division method. Okay, so let's begin. You can see here you are given with an example a cubic equation and you need to solve it. Find the value of x. So as you know because the degree the highest power is 3 so the roots number of roots will be 3. Now we need to find out all those three roots, but for the first root we can do hidden trial, right? So for hidden trial, you know, you have to split this 2 and 3 and any of these in positive and negative sign will be this root of this, right? I mean, you need to multiply first and last, 6 times 2 is 12 and factorize it. So let's check with 2. 2 cube, 2 square, 13 times 2 is 6, 26, sorry. So, 8 to the 16, 2 to the 4, 26 plus 6. So, this is 26 minus 26, 0. Right? That means, x is equal to 2 is your root. Right? Now, let's begin synthetic division method. So, what you need to do in that? You have to write this number here and check it out whether all the coefficients are in decreasing order of their degrees of the variables. So x raised to the power 3, x raised to the power 2, x raised to the power 1 and constant. So only the coefficients you need to write down with their signs, respective signs. Okay, let's say if x would not be there, then you can take 0 x okay don't skip that completely thereafter what you need to do first first number should be there should not be written anything here so 2 thereafter you need to multiply this with this so 2 times 2 is 4 now add these to 5 again 2 times 5 is 10 add these to minus 3 2 times minus 3 is minus 6 add these to 0 this is, this is your constant, right? So this number is your remainder, which is 0. Now this is your quotient. And quotient, as you know, it always have degree less than or equal to the divisor. Um, sorry, dividend. So you can see, dividend has 3 degree. So it will be of the degree 2. 2x square, 5x minus 3 equals 0. Now for these, you have already found one. I told you how to do synthetic division in any of the equation. Now you know how to solve this, whether by quadratic formula or splitting the term method. So 3 times 2 is 6. So 6x minus x minus 3. We split it so that we can have minus 6 in terms of multiplication. And in addition, plus 5. 6 minus 1 is 5. Okay. So you can take 2x as common. x plus 3. Minus 1 common. x plus 3. So x plus 3. And 2x minus 1 equals 0. So x is minus 3 and 1 by 2. So there are your 3 roots. Okay. So in this way, you can use synthetic division method. So if... I hope you like this video and if so then don't forget to like, share and subscribe my channel. Till my next video, take care of yourself. Bye-bye.